you looking for a bike bell that is going to get people's attention if you're out on the street? I just recently got this bell right here. Can you see that? And it is really loud. Let me show you. So, are you ready? Brace yourself. So that's pretty loud. You're going to get the attention of other people or cars out on the road or even on the bike path. It does have two buttons here. One toggles through the different sounds. There's four different sounds and then one actually activates that sound. So brace yourself again. I'm going to toggle through the sounds. That is so loud. I'm not sure I would use that. This is the one I use for the bike path. And then back to that one. Now, that one toggles through the four different sounds. And then this button here is when you want to blow the horn. It's when I'm riding and I'm a little bit far away from this, I can't see the symbols on there. So what I did, can you see that? I marked it so I would know which one. And I just used a paint marker that I happen to have around. It's gold, so it really shows up well. And I just marked it right around there. So when I'm on the bike, I don't have to, oh my gosh, which one was it? Was it, was it left or right? I uh, can't remember. Um, and so I have this one here. So let's take a look at mounting this onto my commuter bike. So this is real easy to mount. It comes with this strap here. And the first part hooks on the inside. Mount it where you would like it. And then the buttons to control it, I'll put over here closer to where my hand is gonna be. Then as I'm riding along, and actually I'd probably have this down so it's not sticking up. And then I'm riding along, oh, blow my horn. On my gravel bike, the circumference on my handlebar is too large to put the bell on. So what I did was I put it into my handlebar bag and then I strapped the controller piece under the straps to hold down the handlebar bag. Plus, if I'm riding on a path, the bell really is a little too loud. So if I have it in my handlebar bag, or even if you had a top tube bag or some sort of frame bag, that would probably work also. But it muffles the sound a little bit and so it's not as jarring. As per the instructions, it states, please do not use this product indoors or in confined spaces so as to not bring trouble to them. I did this in my garage, and I don't think I brought trouble to anyone. Another point of interest in the instructions is before the first use, please turn the bicycle horn full of electricity. It's actually very simple to charge. You'll see a red light when it's still charging and that red light will turn green once it's fully charged. Well thank you for standing in my garage with me while I showed you the We Love Bikes T-002 bike bell or bike horn would be a more accurate description. I just thought it was really cool. Right, see you guys out there.